Welcome to Triple Play Storage and Campground located in Canastota, South Dakota. My name is Misty Miller and I'm going to tell you a little bit about our project today. Um, a little over a year ago, probably July of 2013, um, a realtor friend of ours had this property that has been listed and said, I think this would be a good idea for you. Um, it's a good potential, it's a service that's needed in our community. And so we took a look at it and said, okay, what, what can we do with the campground? The campground hadn't probably been used in 14 years. That's how long we've lived in Canastota. And we thought, we're not campers and we don't know anything about camping. So I really wasn't too sure about the campsites. But the storage unit sites, as you can see behind me, um, we developed a plan to put 24 storage units with three different sizes. There's 12 that are 10 by 25. We have 12 that are 10 by 20. And we can divide, take the wall divider out between and make them 10 by 45 as the first one is here. So we can customize it to each customer's needs. Um, the whole project started last July with the idea. Um, we were put in touch with Nancy Larson at SEFP and through her help, we put a business plan together. She helped us get um, numbers that we needed. She helped us get um, a feasibility study to see if uh, storage units would even go in our small community. And through that process, we put a nice business plan together went to the Small Business Association. They helped us over review the budget, said it was realistic. So put a packet together, took it to the bank and got some financing. That took about nine months. And finally, at the end of February, we were granted our loan. And in April, we put um, motion into place as to who was going to do the construction and we put dollars, invested dollars in down payments and um, we are located just directly across from the baseball softball complex, a newly renovated baseball, football and softball con complex used all through the summer into the fall. That was another great community project. So. The storage units were another community project that really needed to be done. There really was a need here for um, families, for people with lawn mowers and snowmobiles and motorcycles and just odds and ends to get them out of their yards, out of their garages, um, take all those totes full of old, you know, young kids clothes and all the toys and take them out of their house and put them somewhere so they can use those spare bedrooms again and use those garages again. Um, as of July 1st, the building for the storage units is complete. And as of today, which is July 17th, we are already half full. So the need was there. We filled the need. And again, without Nancy and SEFP, we wouldn't have been able to even see that the need was here. Um, she did all the legwork, the hard work. Um, we just went along for the ride. Our campground is not yet started uh, developing. We've done some demolition and reconstruction of it. And we're just a little bit, um, we're waiting for the dirt work to be done. We're putting all new electrical in four units um, towards the front. They'll be pull through with an access road on the front, um, 50 foot pads. We like to be able to accommodate um, passerbys, people coming off the interstate, um, people traveling to the Orman Clinic. We get a lot, of custom, a lot of clients to the clinic like to travel with their motorhomes throughout the year family reunions, weddings, all sorts of things. Um, so come on down Canastota and see Triple Play Campground and Storage.